Hello, my name is Dr Caroline Diamond and I'm the Director of Public Health for Torbay. I'm talking to you today as unfortunately the number of cases of COVID in Torbay have continued to rise. In the last week we saw 327 cases which brings our rate to 236 per 100,000 of the population. This means unfortunately we now have a rate higher than Devon, Cornwall and even Plymouth. We've now got cases in 14 of our care homes and in 35 of our schools and nurseries. Sadly, we're also seeing more deaths and this brings the total of deaths since February to 55. The local hospital is now also under pressure with an increasing number of inpatients with COVID and also many staff who are having to self-isolate. However, cases are not limited to these places. There is now also widespread community transmission. It's across all ages and a worrying number are now in the older age group who are particularly vulnerable. Across the Bay, many of us continue to do what we can to fight this virus and I'm grateful for the many thousands who are doing just that. Today is Remembrance Day and many of you will be remembering the people who died in the war. We've got another battle on our hands and it's in our own Bay. It's against Covid. Our most effective weapon in this is to follow the guidance and especially, and this is really important, to self-isolate. We must self-isolate if we think we've got COVID or we think we may be a close contact of a case. If people don't do this, we'll begin to lose this war against COVID. The cases and the deaths will keep on going up and our care homes, our schools and our hospitals will come under more pressure. We need to keep our care homes open. We need to enable our kids to still go to school. We need to keep our hospital open for when we need it. We need to prevent those deaths escalating. No one is immune to this virus and no one is either immune to the impacts of it. Please take it seriously. Thank you.